Hello guys, welcome back. Today is an exciting day because we are currently headed to Cherry Creek, which is a mall in Denver. Hey. We are going to Nordstrom, one, to look at strollers and car seats. We're going to be there with our compadres, Luis and Noemi. We're just going to look around and see what's going on the baby registry. And then I also want to get some fall clothes for Franco because he has grown out of all of his sets. Ya le quedan como brincacharcos. So I want to see what Zara has because that's usually where I get all of his matching sets and his fall clothes. Strawberry acai. Strawberry acai. Lemonade. But our first stop before that is Starbucks. We're getting a little refresher and a little fall drink for Jonathan and a treat. That's what we're currently doing. I'm also working on a thumbnail so I can upload a video for you guys right now, which I wanted to upload it at 1 and it's already 12.57. So I'm going to stop talking and try to upload this right now. We made it to the mall. I'm not sure where our compadres are at. But in the meantime, I do want to get an Instagram picture. Um, I also got my little Starbies. I love how sour it is because it eases my nausea. First sort is Gap and Frank was in his Mickey Mouse era and these have like the little stickies so I think we're gonna go with these. Did you hear this over there? Yeah. I think that's good for him. Yeah. We made it to Zara and I'm a little disappointed because my cosas que me gustaron tanto. We just got Franco a few like staples like this. Sheeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
Qué bonito, sí está. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what we got at Gap. And then we went to Zara. And we got him some staples there. Mira, ¿cómo se le ¿Qué es? Y Stitch. Qué bonito. Mira, ese qué bonito. Oh, fantasies. Mira. ¿Te gustan? La nuestra foto en las calabazas. Ay, oh, qué bonito este. Mira. Good morning, it is Monday and today, as you guys can see, we're doing a little week reset. Saturday and Sunday, I take my weekend serious. I do not do anything but spend time with Franco and do activities with him and stuff. And Sundays, I'm usually in my PJs all day until we're gonna go out in the afternoon. So we take Mondays serious around this house. So today we're going to reset. We actually have a dumpster coming here soon, probably in the next hour or so. It is currently 7.50. We're gonna clean out the garage. We're gonna clean out the house and get everything ready for a good week. I really wanna declutter. I also wanna go get some baskets to organize Franco's toys here in the living room because this living room has just turned into Franco's play area. So I wanna make it look cute. Um, I also want to go through his toys and get rid of a bunch of things from him too. So many things are happening this week. I'm so excited to vlog it all. I'll bring you guys along. Hopefully you like it. And ¿qué haces, papá? Hola. Te mande. Me. Mamá. Te ven. Me. Mamá. Mande. Mamá. Mande. Papá. ¿Ese quién es? Di yo. <laughs> Just finished making breakfast for Jonathan. He's having a little breakfast sandwich on a bagel. Franco will be having a little egg as well, and I'm making my eggs too. Everybody now finished eating breakfast. Franco amazes me with how much he eats throughout the day. We all finished eating, and now I'm upstairs. I'm gonna Go ahead and take my everything shower. But first, I'm gonna change our sheets. I try to do this every Monday. Some weeks, I'm ahead of things. Some weeks, I'm super behind things. And this week happens to be something I'm behind. I'm gonna take this out. I like to make my room the most minimal space possible. I actually have another package coming in the mail today from Amazon, which is toddler cushion bed rail so that he doesn't fall from the bed. So the crib was a little bit of a safety net in case he did, which he hasn't, but... You know how things go, you usually take it away and they'll fall the next day. So I'm gonna take this out, put it back in his nursery, and then I'm going to do the bed. Laundry basket ready to go in for the 
next load because the first load is my bed sheets take a good half an hour for myself we're done with an everything shower and now it is 11 50. i have 10 minutes before i have to get franco down for a nap so i think i'm gonna do a little bit of plucking up my eyebrows because they look a little dirty and then i'm going to get the room ready for him to go down so when he goes down i can get ready super fast and we can film the podcast <laughs> It has been a hectic day. I lost the nail. <laughs> I'm about to take them all off because I have a nail appointment tomorrow. But I am about to start uh, organizing Franco's little play area down here. He went down for bed kind of late because we got back home from the store a little bit late. So it is 9.03. I think he went down like at 8.30, which is late for him. My goal is usually 7 p.m. sharp but let me show you the current state of his play area we have this tv console that is so nice and i feel like it's gonna look so good with these we bought these jonathan actually put them out i hadn't even seen them until he showed me and they go perfect with our mat so i think i'm gonna put them right there and put all of his books all of his toys so he has a little toy basket over here but since they are never displayed he never plays with them so i'm gonna go through this his absolute current obsession is all these animals and his mickey mouse we actually bought him this at pj max today because he saw it and as soon as he sees anything mickey mouse he is taking it so that's what we got and these are his obsessions so i'm just gonna organize everything into these leftover coffee from brunch this morning since i'm pregnant i know that by the time my due date comes around i will not be having long nails for probably six months after i give birth i think that's how long i waited when i had franco so i am going to take advantage and get my long nails back on for the remainder of the pregnancy and i'm so excited so let's go do our first fall set You guys, it has been a hectic week, but we made it to Friday and Stacy and Denny get here tomorrow. And all day today, I've just been cleaning, trying to organize and you know, all the good things before someone comes to visit me. It is currently 7.20 and Jonathan just went upstairs to try to put Franco down for bed. So while he's up there, I'm gonna head over to Marshall's and get a couple things I need, like blankets. I honestly threw away all of my blankets in the dumpster that I mentioned was coming earlier this week because they were on the garage for 
a long time. I did see spiders in there, so I definitely just threw everything away. So I need to go repurchase some blankets and maybe a couple more things while we're there. Before I head out, I'm gonna eat something super quick. This week, I literally have not been able to enjoy a meal because I've been stressing, trying to declutter, trying to get everything ready. So I need to show you guys what I've been doing this week that has been saving my life. I've been eating these factor meals. These are literally fresh, never frozen meals, chef prepared, dietitian approved, no prep no mess heat and eat in two minutes and it is america's number one ready to eat meal kit which factor is owned by hellofresh and we use them so often so we love to switch from hellofresh to factor because some weeks we can't cook and some weeks we can so for example this week i was so busy that these are so nice to just take out of the fridge pop into the microwave for two minutes and then eat them Today I'm gonna have the mushroom, tomato, and goat cheese cavatappi. One thing about me is I love pasta, girl. Factor makes meeting your nutrition goals easier than ever by delivering fresh, never frozen, dietitian approved meals right to your doorstep. If you're too busy this fall to cook, but you want to make sure you're eating well, with Factor you can skip the extra trip to the grocery store and the chopping, prepping, and cleaning up too, while still getting the flavor and nutritional quality you need. I'm literally going to swallow my food and then head to Marshall's because I want to get there before they close. They close at 9.30 and I'm cutting it short, girl. But yeah, Factor cuts down on grocery shopping and cooking, which is probably the best thing for me, especially if I could just pop it in the microwave and have it ready in two minutes. It is very suitable for my busy lifestyle with a toddler. Something that I love about Factor is that it has a lot of nutritious options to keep my fridge stocked. They do have juices and smoothies that you can take as snacks throughout the day. So they have you covered for lunch, dinner, and snacks. I have this cold pressed juice. It's apple, beet, and ginger. You guys know I never go without giving you a discount code. So right now you can head to factor75.com or click the link below and use my code BlancaJ50 to get 50% off your first Factor box. That is factor75.com or click the link down below in the description box and use my code BlancaJ50 for 50% off your first Factor box. Now without further ado, before they close Marshalls, <laughs> let's head out. Good morning guys, it is Saturday, October 7th and today Stacy, Denny and SJ land here in Colorado and we get to see them and spend time with them. The only other time they've ever been here was for our cabin trip last December for Vlogmas and they came with everyone else of course. SJ wasn't born yet. Then a year before that they came down for my baby shower so it was time to do a trip where we just hang out and soak them in here in Colorado. We're coming at the perfect time because it's fall outside like the leaves are dying and falling and looking beautiful beautiful as ever so as you guys know one thing about me is i absolutely love to host and it's my passion to host basically basically franco's nursery is our guest room slash nursery because franco doesn't sleep in there but he does have all his clothes he showers in there and that's his room but we also use it as a guest room because we can put a bed in there and no one sleeps in there so it's just like our guest room slash nursery so we are fixing it up right now i finished washing their bed sheets and this little blanket is so cute and so warm it's currently oh it just turned 12 p.m so they get here in about six hours so i'm gonna bring you guys along the day and see how we get everything ready and then we will pick them up I'm so excited. We're in the nursery. If you hear anything in the background, it's Franco's white noise. I have the camera with me because he's napping currently. But let me show you the current state. We have the bed that we just moved in here, the crib. SJ can like hang out in here and sleep in here. And then we have the cuadros that should go up there. Franco's name will probably go there. And this is the current state of this here. These are washed, everything that's washed and ready to be put on. This is all donation and this is the middle is trash and then the sides are donation. So that's the current state of this room. So let's get it together.
All right, I washed the shower curtains. I just put the liner on. Now I'm gonna put the actual curtain on. And then I washed all of our guest towels. So we're gonna set up the bathroom now. Since the start. I needed new soap and hand lotion for this bathroom so i just ended up getting this it is in the scent fresh linen and when i smelt this i was like um actually i'm gonna take it for myself <laughs> so cute look how cute let's do the honor I'm not gonna dry my hands on the clean towels. I'm just gonna. Mmm, <laughs> it smells so good, so fresh, clean, and beautiful. Jonathan brought a little pick me up, a little caramel coffee. While I was doing the bed, I forgot that I didn't buy a mattress topper, and that is a big deal for me because. My mom has always had us used to sleeping with mattress toppers and protectors. So Jonathan ran. As soon as Franco woke up from his nap, Jonathan got him up and took him to the store. I just finished Franco's load of laundry for the week. I usually do this on Sundays, but it's Saturday. I'm making sure that he has all his clothes clean and ready and I don't have to come in this room at all while they're here. And then I also washed the crib sheet so let me put that on as well It is now 4 13 and they are on their way stacy sent me a picture telling me that they were coming already they were on the plane and they get here at around 6 20 p.m so i just showered i had to get it clean because i was sweating girl from everywhere getting ready so i can start making their little welcome basket which you guys know is my absolute favorite part of hosting is making a welcome basket. We're just gonna pick them up, come home, eat, and then have them rest because Denny and Jonathan run half a marathon tomorrow at like 7 a.m. So let me get ready and I'll be right back. I'm now ready. I'm gonna go get everything for the welcome baskets so I can get started on them. It is 4.35, so we have about an hour and a half. Okay, you know how I said I need to come get everything for the welcome baskets? Well, I just got a package in today that I ordered for SJ and I always order from Itty Bitty Babe. She also has sent me a lot of PR and I just got a huge box with my order, but she added extra things. So let me show you the first thing, which is so cute. It's this Mickey Mouse Halloween pillow. I was so shook that something came this big. So let me show you guys. Look at this. More to add to his fall wardrobe. Yes. Oh, I think this is what I got as a little beanie. Oh, look at the little hat. How freaking cute. And this is also what I ordered SJ, like a little set. How cute. Set this over. Oh. <laughs> See? Oh, I need to do one Franco, mira pa! Oh, I think she sent one for me. Oh, oh she sent one for you and me, babe. For me? Yeah. Oh, nice. She sent over some beanies, which is perfect because I was I was in the search for some beanies for Frank. So we got a little brown and a white one. Oh, how cute. Oh. 
Hier. Wow, wenn man nur schaut, wie groß ist. Okay, that is so freaking cute. Thank you so much to Eddie Bitty Bay. Oh no, he's so excited. Kippa, te gusta? Yes. Yes. A ver, ¿cómo le hacen aquí más? Oh my goodness. And the last thing she sent is, oh, this is so cute, a little cup for my smoothies. It says, I've got this, I'm love, I'm brave, I'm strong, I'm smart, I matter. <gasps> How absolutely gorgeous. Okay, we're about to shower Franco. Jonathan left to pick them up. And let me show you a little trick my mom showed me <laughs> when I am done cleaning the bathroom. I try to make it, it's not as pretty as my mom's. Oh yes. 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 Wow. Well, at least I tried. But anyways, I'm getting the little welcome basket ready. So, so far, I have some cookies. I have hot Cheetos. I have makeup wipes, which girls usually forget makeup wipes. I usually do, so I'm like, maybe she'll forget them. I don't know. And then I have two running shirts here. One for Stacy, one for Denny. Uh, and then I have the cutest little outfits for SJ. They're so cute. And we are almost done. Okay, Franco is all showered in his little Halloween PJs. Dile yes. Hi. Ay, mi amor. Let me just show you guys how the room ended up looking like and what they're gonna walk into. Open it. And this is how it looks. There's, I have some little muslin wraps for SJ. Have the crib, the bed, their little welcome basket, their towels. And then over here, I have towels for SJ. And this is just Franco's little shelf, which is so cute. And that is basically how it looks. And the bathroom looks like this. We have the little bathtub for SJ if they wanna use it. Have some extra toilet paper. And everything is ready. Right, I just sat. We are in the waiting game. And it's so funny because we took out the baby Bajorn um, from the garage so that SJ could sit on it. And Franco is literally attempting to get in there. Look. How are you there? Oh no! Just remember that we also had the bumbo in the garage. So I just took it out so that SJ can sit. It's right here, it's so cute. So we'll have that out for them. And we have the baby Bajorn and everything is ready. Now we just wait. They're here! Viene bien, feliz, bien contento. I am so excited to finally have them here. And like you guys are here to stay at my house, you know? La, el otro, la otra vez se fueron luego, luego a Winter Park. The cabin. Yes. Oh yeah, vamos para arriba. Ven. Enseñale su cuarto a Stacy. Yes, Jay. Yay. Go ahead, the first one on your right. Oh my goodness, you changed it. I did. Baby, can you help me vlog? This is her favorite. Stop. Oh, how cute! Oh, green. I know. Stop. Wow, Franco, I love it. Mira, <laughs> me you guys look. Is this for us? Yes. Yeah, it's the changing table. How yes. cute! We're gonna open my PR package from Blanca J. I got two cameras on me. Oh, you guys, Jay, some clothes. Yay. Six to twelve. Love that for us. Mm -hmm. I yes. think I heard it in one of your vlogs. Yeah, <laughs> like, he's that's 12 months already. What he's no wearing. Way. Yes, girl. Esta lo acá ahorita lo puedo lavar. Oh my goodness. Look at how cute this is. <laughs> Dile, thank you, tía. Dile. Dile, oh, gracias a ti, tía. Gracias, tía. Oh, <laughs> oh my god, this is so cute. <laughs> he's a little boho um, beige baby. I yes. love it. 
<laughs> the beanie. Like just in case it gets super cold. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, we, we didn't bring, bring one. We didn't bring no? One. Okay, good. Look how cute. <laughs> wow, Franco. Dile gracias, tia. You spoil me. You spoil me. Oh my goodness, I love it. <laughs> oh my gosh, pa, look. Mira pa. Oh my goodness, this is for me? Yeah. Oh, I love it. And it's oversized. Thank you. We got a little basket. Mm -hmm. We got some nutter butters. Yum. I honestly, I'm gonna eat them right now. I'm so hungry. <laughs> we got some makeup remover wipes. Love that for me. Oh, is this for Denny? For both of you guys. Oh, how cute. Oh, Boulder Running Company. Love that. Yeah. And then, Perry Queen. Perry Queen. <laughs> wow. Rock Colorado. I love it. <laughs> thank you, thank you so much. No, thank you guys for coming. We're so happy to have you here. Franco fell asleep around an hour ago. Stacy is now putting SJ to sleep. We just had dinner, very late dinner. We caught up a little bit, and now everyone is signing off because the guys have to run their half marathon tomorrow. So I'm so excited to bring you guys along. But for now, I'm signing off for the night because we all have to go to sleep. I'm so glad that I'll have you with me. With you, I feel like I'm dreaming. But I'm awake, I'm not here sleeping. By my side, you give good company. Left and right, I'll keep you safe. When I'm with you, I won't hesitate. Now you got me fully baby.